we're gonna hit the boat ramp in hopes of finding something good today. You gonna Sorry, take boss. <laughs> You're gonna have to get somebody else now. Mm. We're gonna show you Richard's little find in a minute. I'm Mr. Lysik, and today we're up in Seattle. I've got my good buddy Richard here. Well, Richard's missing right now, and I've got like Nick and Chris who like they think it's a little too cold. We're supposed to be getting ready to go diving. Freezing. Well, get in, your, get in your dry suit and you'll be a little bit warmer. Jared, stop putting your parking tickets on my car. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, pay, pay that for me if you would, all right? So Chris, when we were up in Seattle earlier today, Chris got himself a parking ticket for $44. The dive light I'm gonna be using today is the Orca Torch 910V. That's right, it's a video light with 5,000, 2,000, and 500 lumens. So check out the link in the description below for all of the specs on that little guy. I got a buddy that's a nurse. I had a patient that came in and uh, he was claiming he was invisible. So she went back and she told the uh, doctor, that, what should I do? The doctor said, well, tell him I'm not gonna be able to see him today. <laughs> you like that one, Kiara? Sure. <laughs> but what I really like about these Seattle dives, Kiara, we have crabs up here. And some of you may not have seen my little uh, Seattle Ferris wheel video that we did. We found six phones, a bicycle, a boom box, as well as a computer over there. So be sure to check out the other Seattle Ferris wheel video we did, because I gotta say, it's pretty good. We'll see you in a bit. Later, later. Bye. Whoa. <laughs> Look at this dock. It's bouncy. Poor baby crab under there, Kiara. He was big and red. I mean, well, his body was like this big. Somebody either ripped his claws off and threw him back in so he has no claws to eat with, or another animal came along and boop, boop, took his claws off. Mm -hmm. Yeah, poor guy. I don't know how he's gonna eat and survive, but he's making it. Like, there's one phone with barnacles all over it, but the other phone I found under there, I had to leave it. There's these really cool plants. It's like orange and it was about that tall, growing to on the phone. Oh so wow. It's actually the first phone I've actually left underwater because it was kind of serving a purpose. It's like it's a little barrier reef. What kind of phone? Uh, a smartphone of some sort. I didn't know if it was like an old phone or like a smartphone or whatever. Yeah, yeah, I'm not quite sure. All right, 
Here we go again. See you later. Out these glasses. These can be not my uh, new reading glasses. There, Kiara. Yeah, Beautiful. Oh, you, you think so? Does it? The, wait, with the hat or without the hat? Like, which one do I without, look out? Smarter. Look smarter. Yeah. Or smarter without the hat. Like old wise. <laughs> As I mentioned to you before, Kiara, I found two phones. One of those phones I left under there because it had some sea life growing on it. So I ended up with one phone, a gold coin today, Kiara. Look at that. My first treasure. We're gonna be able to retire if. It was real. However, Ew. it's not real. Oh, I found a prop under there, and it was really cool. I was like, I was dropping it, Kiara, and it was going down in the bottom. Found a key. Another key, also. This uh, one is the key to the city. Ooh. Is that what that is? Yep. That's what I need. Given to us by the mayor of Seattle. Mayor himself. You know what I'm hoping for? I'm hoping that the uh, mayor in uh, Portland gives us, the, gives us the key to the city, too because there's some access that I'd like over there. So, Mr. Mayor in Portland, if you're watching, we would like the key to your city. A rope, a couple of little boat rollers, bottles, can, and you may have seen, oh, this is actually kind of a good little ball. Underwater, uh, we were actually playing ball. Richard and I, he was like throwing it, and I was catching it. We're gonna show you Richard's little find in a minute. We'll come back to that one. Nick here might actually retire. So let's jump yeah. over to uh, Chris. Chris, you're uh, next. The knife, banana weight, garbage, whatever that thing is. Piece of rope, oh, and I saw a sea lion. Show me. How big was it? The coin. Oh yeah. That's, it's about that, as big as Nick. I found this coin. It's probably just a token for the ferry, but it's neat looking. You gotta see what Nick's so, got over know, here. Basically just the usual garbage bottles, old, new, you know, this, that, and the other. But this time I found the diamonds. That's right. Oh yeah. <laughs> I don't have to go to work. You gonna Sorry, boss. <laughs> You're gonna have to get somebody else now. Because I'm out. <laughs> I think those are real. I know, I don't know what's going on there, but. yeah. Because if, if they were fake, they would have uh, tarnished and uh, yeah. the, the, like the... Uh, It'd be interesting to find out. Oh, somebody already stole like four or five of them. That's, that's pretty nice though. Yeah. Yeah, test them out. Take them yeah. into uh, Saturdays. Yeah. yeah, take them into Claire's. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I found this cage of some sort. Oh, uh, bait oh, trap. Yeah. Oh bait yeah, trap. that's what it is. Five, six, seven, eight or nine rollers for boat trailer. Uh, yeah. Makeup. Doesn't look like it's any good anymore. <laughs> Actually, I think that is here. But that, if you take if you take a look at it here, what you do, what they use it for is because we're not too far from that. What's the uh, Seattle Mariners, right? So what they do is they take it and they put it underneath their eyes like that. Oh. What it does is it helps with the uh, reflection when they're out playing oh, baseball. Yeah. Take me out to the ball game. Where is it? Football. 
No, no, they do it for baseball. They don't do it for football, do they? Yeah. Football, just, yeah. just baseball? Oh, don't they only do one eye though? I messed it up. I don't don't they only do one eye or do they do two eyes? <laughs> Did you guys ever do that when you are in Little League? No. no. Oh, all right, I guess it's just me. I think it's football. All right. <laughs> Fair sunglasses? Fair sunglasses. And? You, I think that you scored the best, I mean, other than Nick that's gonna retire, <laughs> um, <laughs> you found, I mean, oh, nice phone wallet. he found a phone wallet. So, not just a phone wallet, but I mean, we got the ID of, uh, yeah, we gotta track her down today, so hopefully, fingers crossed, we'll be able to track her down. Also have her credit card for Alaska Airlines, so we're gonna be able to all take a vacation before we give this back to her. Mm -hmm. What else have we got in here? I mean, a lot of credit cards. So we're gonna be using the Venture One Capital Card. It looks like a credit union credit card. We got the Alaska credit card. We've got the ID, Allstate Insurance. We also know that she drives a Subaru. And a Chase Sapphire card. And none of them, none of, guys, none of them have expired yet. I say we go shopping. Go shopping! I say we go shopping first. <laughs> one for each. There we go. One for, there's one for you. There's one for you. Yeah. There's one for you. There's an extra one for you, Kiara. <laughs> so we're gonna do everything we can today to track her down. Fingers crossed, we find her. We found the house, and you gotta beware of dog. Here we go, uh oh. I hear the dog. I don't see a car out here, so I don't know if they're home. I don't think that they're home. Hey camera, we got your camera, we got your, look, look, we got your phone, we got your ID, good to go. I hope it's still the right house. All right. I mean, I guess we could like try and look around for like some mail or something. We can ask the uh, neighbor. Hey, excuse me. Hi, does you still live here? You look insane. Well, let's check the mail here. Can't, it has a lock on it. Well. They'll yes, figure it out. Do neighbors know each other around here? It appears no. We did our part. We returned the wallet. We hope it's the right house. Hopefully. We'll see. Good luck. That wraps up another episode of Ventures with Purpose. Thanks for hanging out with us. Later, later. Bye bye. Down.